The overall goal of this experimental procedure is to understand synaptic dynamics in a single neuron under different activation conditions. This method can help answer key questions in the synaptic plasticity field, such as revealing changes in the molecular composition of synapses upon modulation of the neuron's activity. The main advantage of this technique is that it allows the semi-automated analysis of multiple aspects of synapses, including their number, distribution, and the level of enrichment of molecular components at the synapses. For this experiment, collect the flies into normal vials within six hours of occlusion. Load the collection vials into a transparent acrylic rack. In a small incubator set to 25 degrees Celsius, position the rack at a precise distance from an LED panel, where the light exposure is at an average of 1,000 lux. Then, rear flies for one to three days using one of the following conditions, either constant darkness, 12 hours of light followed by 12 hours of darkness, or constant light. Later, dissect and stain the brains using standard techniques. To mount the fly brains, load a micropipette with mounting medium and deposit two 2 microliter drops at the center of a microscope slide about 2 centimeters apart. Place a cover slip onto each drop and the gape between about 0.2 millimeters. Then,